If you're sick of your stock plumbing on your pool filters, cracking, wearing from the sun within a couple years, this is a hack to reuse your stock ends, make them fit rigid PVC that lasts for years. Try and cut as close to here as you can so you have all this space to be able to glue into your PVC. Once your end is removed, you're going to want to make a small bevel around the outside, sand off this lettering, and get this little hump here out as smooth as possible. Clean your pipe ends, make sure they're clean. We are going to test fit our piece now. Before you glue, you're going to want to make sure your collar is in the right position because it will not be able to be added later. Okay, here we go. Okay, we're going to have to do it again. By the collar worn in right, so it goes where you can still screw it on. I did have to take and sand the inside of my PVC. It is a very, very tight fit. You're going to want to be on a clean surface. I kind of ding that, but it should be fine. There's a giant rubber seal. So now you know it fits. You're going to start gluing up everything. So on your Coleman pools, your outlet is the right size for your big tubing. Your inlet, with this setup, you would have had to use an adapter. I'm gonna install this here so I can use all my PVC the correct size and a lot more flow. With the retaining ring from this piece, so we know how big a hole to make in this here. So you want to carefully cut around the line you made. I usually try to go just a touch smaller at first. That way I don't cut too much material so I can come back and always make it bigger. You can't make it smaller though. Fitting it from the outside, it is just a little small. I think I can make it work though. Once you have it up there, it's easier to trim now around. Be careful not to put a hole in your pool. Finally got a pretty good seal here. Just gonna push this material back around here. One might still need trimmed a little more. I'm gonna try it again. That looks good. We will have to check it for leaks, but 
I think we're all right. Screw in your collar. So this piece does come with this filter kit that I bought, but it was unable to be used for this pool kit because of the piping not being the right size. So now that I've altered it and made it so it is, you can see this is the pipe that I came up with. None of it's glued yet. I'm gonna do that last. I just wanna do my final fit on this piece first. A tight fit here, because there's a gasket right here, and this is tapered in now. So like I said, don't glue up your plumbing until you got everything fitted exactly where you wanted it. Makes it a real headache. And go ahead and install all your threaded couplers. And one of the great features of doing this is now you have a shut off. So you can shut your water off, drain your chlorine basket when your pump is off, put your tablets in without having water flowing all the time into here and having to put pipes too high or whatnot, it makes it very convenient. 